here is an update on how we've done and the progress but unfortunately I ran out of um, paint so I have to wait till tomorrow and um, I was having difficulties uh, with the wind because I was doing all this uh, spraying or painting outside so if you can see something flying I think is the fumes on this um, finishing now you can see like fumes some like smoke so I came all the way here I ran out of paint and um, look how everything turned out to be pretty good and uh, just want to show you the progress now I'm in the garage and um, this is how everything has turned out to be so I get a finish of this side and that will give me the leverage or the opportunity um, to do what I was doing or what I'm going to do. And I was just, if you see me, what I was doing and uh, is the wind was pushing all this little dirt onto uh, a paint that's not even dried yet. But um, it was so windy, it's hot today, but um, it was nice because I have to do this. So that's just a glare from the... Uh, the lights on the camera so this is how everything um, turns out turn out to be right now and uh, you can see some like smoke see is the last container here I used this is a cherry like a, a red cherry and um, I did just want to show you how everything goes. <clears throat> if I really wanted to, I would have done some kind of combination. I have a black container. I would have done some kind of uh, changes or mixture or whatever it is. Uh, being creative, maybe I would have done another color from here all the way down and uh, from the rest. So if you can see there are some few spots there. I didn't even heat because it was windy outside and um, this side here the box is almost done here the front and I uh, see how nice it is so this is just a glare from the lights I can show you again and this is what it is so the box was cheap not that expensive but need a TLC so I have to do here tomorrow by God's grace and um, do this side and the back so the paint was cons consumed um, from the inside and uh, for some reason the, um, the orange box did pretty well it didn't take that much paint at all I think it's just the cherry is different and um i was surprised so guys check this out this is a sharp the other one was um remember what i told you see this one sharp so i didn't take it this time so i just spin it over so tell me what you think like and subscribe jw solo usa more progress to go or more progress i have to do Oh, let me show you this. The top. Oh, I got some sticky paint. I would have opened this. I forgot to open it. So, it's a little paint that's not even dry right there. So, held the door. So, inside is all painted. So, that compartment I painted, if I would have utilized that paint on the sides, it would have took me um, a long distance of uh, almost a completion. I we'll have to pump a lot of um, paint in there because the wind, I was just pumping it and I flipped it. If you see on the top, it's all done. It's just reflection on the light. So it was set that corner right there. I didn't get it. Yeah, I was not trying to do any perfection work here at that time because the wind was against me. I have the mask 
and um, it was difficult to do. That's the only place I can't just do any spraying or painting inside the garage. It will be a whole bunch of paint around um, the, the, the walls on the floor. I don't want that. And it's going to be on the car. So, guys, this is what I've done. I hope you like. So, I'm going to hit some of these other spots here. But this is going to go for different projects. I have some batteries that I, I will have to utilize. They might probably fit in this compartment here. And the bottom here will be for um, something else maybe. Um, here will be a big storage about certain things like uh, inverters or whatever. If I wanted to. But I want to fill this box um, with batteries, you know, different kind of batteries. So each project is going to be using a different batteries. You've seen the 1850, 18650 Panasonics, and you've seen the Volkswagen e-Golf, and you're going to see another a model that is going to be in here. And um, it will be nice to deal with different lithium ion, lithium ion phosphate, or whatever, uh, lithium um prismatic that's what you call it so yeah yeah guys this is what it is so i still have the um if you're curious what kind of paint color is that for your future projects this is what i've used this is a cherry from rustoleum with um glossy protection enamel superior coverage and durability so this is just a 12 ounce which is a 340 grams so i have this another one orange i was thinking probably i can able to paint this box to an orange like the previous one but i decided not to i want to get another different color instead of um um another orange so we're gonna make different colors here and see how everything works for us right at jw solo usa thanks for watching love you guys all stay tuned for the completion of this box and you'll see how everything turned out to be all right bye for now